Breaking DOJ turns over 1.2 million documents related to 2016 election to House Intel Committee by Jim Hoft for the GatewayPundit.com. The Department of Justice turned over uh, some of the 1.2 million documents requested by lawmakers this past week. The documents are related to DOJ activities during the 2016 election. Chad Pergram from Fox News tweeted on Friday that the DOJ turned over some of the 1.2 million documents requested to the House Intelligence Committee. Um, Chad per DOJ turns over some uh, of the 1.2 million documents requested by House Judiciary Committee as part of a congressional probe into DOJ and the election. The Gateway Pundit's Christina Layla reported on Friday the DOJ turned over all documents related to the Russia, all of them, related to the Russia dossier to lawmakers earlier this uh, in the week, according to the Daily Caller Nunez and the House Intel Committee reviewed all FBI and DOJ docs on the dossier, including the FISA apps. Both Sarah Carter and Sean Hannity uh, reported this week Hillary's phony Russia dossier was used to obtain a FISA warrant in order to spy on Trump's campaign. It appears those documents were strictly related to the phony dossier, as if we didn't know. The documents uh, mentioned by Chad Pergram uh, may be a separate set of documents that include the DOJ activity during the 2016 election. It is becoming clear that the Obama, DOJ, and FBI work to spy on and defeat the Trump campaign, which is the largest political scandal in U.S. history. Okay, who's going to jail? That's what I'd like to know, right? They should all be taken down. You see them? Obama, Clinton, right? The head honchos. And uh, Lynch, Comey, Andrew McCabe. And the list goes on because uh, um, all of this, uh, how about the Trump Towers that they got the FISA warrant? Uh, the Russian lawyer, Veselnitskaya there. You, you see, it... it I mean, what are, we, what are they waiting for? Start, start with the arrest. That's what I say. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. And again, thank you so much for watching.